I'm definitely hoping to beat him straight away. Um, can beat him straight away at least. And for all of you that's just tuned in, welcome back to a stream. Haven't had one in a couple of days. I was busy yesterday solving stuff. You know how it goes with life. And of course, those of you that just heard him speaking, that's Wookie with me. Not Nemesis this time, but Wookie with me. No, Nemesis. <laughs> Could normally hear, normally hear it. Uh, that, my, my sister last streaming, like, that's new news to me, like what's going on here? <laughs> oh, we've got 11 followers. There you go mate, and when you start live streaming that's gonna boost up quite nicely. Right, here we go, I'm gonna try this deck out again. Last time for all of you that watched, Sartorius completely took it to me multiple times. So fingers crossed I can actually do something here while I then just keep, wow, well, failing. Start off with a clay man face down. Let's look all space typhoon to start off. There goes my uh, trap card, second coin charge, cup of face. And he now draws two cards. He's got Arcana kind of Force the Lovers out, which is going to flip her effect. It's not going to get past Clayman, though. Right, um, hmm, there's not really much I can do here. I've not got the best Alan of Contacts, or his attack your opponent, draw from Carl with V, let him be. Right. Um, there isn't really anything I can do here. There isn't exactly... Oh no, he's just brought out the world. This is over already. This is over already. He's just brought out the world. Maybe, but the world is 3,100. That is 3,100 attack, that's a little brutal. Not exactly something I particularly want to deal with. Batman, I think, can come out. Um. So yeah, um, uh, this door's looking grim already. Yeah, if I don't do it this time, for all of you that tuned in last time, this guy wrecked me about three or four times in a row. If I don't do it this time, I'm bringing out my custom deck, like I did with Jaden, because I do want to move on in the game and not just keep doing the same guy. Right, he's just got a direct attack on me, i got to do something big here. Right, okay, here we go. Um... Unfortunately, I am about to get, I am about to get a Neo Sal, but it's not going to make a difference because he still has, oh no, I'm not going to get Neo Sal, never mind. Um, he still has that irritating card out, but I will get rid of that. Should hold him back, just slightly, unless he summons again, um, which he hasn't. That means he misses a direct attack on me. As long as I can keep the monsters coming, I can defend. And I haven't drawn a monster. That's typical that this deck is let me down again with the draws. It happens quite frequently at the moment. Right, 
If go get a direct attack on me at 3100, I can't afford to take two more of those attacks. And apparently my turn got skipped for some stupid reason. In fact, he's just completely and utterly destroyed me. Um, this duel is over. Yep. Yeah, like, I think the custom deck is going to come out now. I want to get past Artoria, so hashtag 2OP. I'm not going to use the default custom decks because they are a little bit overpowered, I feel. Um, but I will use this custom deck. I'll only use this custom deck. I will change it up slightly, but I'll do that on the stream now and then. But I won't be actually um, changing much. And that's actually not a good hand. Right, okay, um, we'll bring out Neo the Magic Swordsman, and that's all we can do so far. I'm curious what he's gonna do, second coin toss, cup of A. And I really need to get rid of that second coin toss, he's gonna use a pot of greed. He's gonna bring out Arcana Force the Emperor, who's also gonna use a coin flip. <coughs> And yes, I would like to. I want to get rid of that second coin toss. So without that, he is in all sorts of trouble. We'll bring up Blast Magician, which I kind of don't know what that does. Each time a spell cast out to fair play from spell on this card. Oh, I could have summoned that first and then done that. Uh... Yeah, that's, I could, I should actually use that last, but let's get rid of that, and let's take control with Blast Magician. And if Blast Magician somehow survives here, um, can most, oh, he's used a second coin toss, already a second coin toss, if he go attack with the lovers, second coin toss again, which is just annoying, yes, he will attack with the lovers. Alright, he's going to use the first of fate. Right, okay, we will lay that down and I'll lay down another Blast Magician so I can get some very quick damage done on him when this is done. Yeah. Alright, yes, I want to activate that. Zoma the Spirit comes out. He will most likely kill Zoma the Spirit here. And he just got the Magician out. Second coin toss. And yes, he's killed Zoma, but that's perfectly fine me. He loses life points. Right, Red Dark Red Enchanter is going to come out now. Alright, he gets powder if this card is no so let's do each time a spell card's actually a fair play for him. Yep. Now see, this card generally is actually very good, Dark Red Enchanter. You can never go wrong with it. And he's got 300 life points left. isn't the fool I should be fine like it's the fool okay never mind I won't destroy that anytime soon um, and I kind of forgot to put man eater bug face down that's fine if he goes for attacking it I can destroy him is he gonna be stupid enough to destroy it that's the main question yes he will be well Sartorius has now lost 
because there's just no way he's gonna counter that and it is over. Alright, well we've finally got past Sartorius, we've gained some Arcana Force cards, very nice, I'll definitely be uh, doing that deck in the future. And uh, it looks like now we're against B Jato time. It looks like we're now against Blair Flanagan. Oh, Soul Reaper. That is actually a very good card. Soul Reaper. Cannot be destroyed. Well, Baron von Jaden, so uh, Spirit Reaper, sorry, not Soul Reaper. Welcome back, I am now against Blair Flanagan, it looks like. Future changes. Blair Flanagan, I have faced her on the DS, but I cannot remember her actual uh, deck. Ah yes, oh I'm Chaz. Okay, well something like that, yeah, something like that. I can't remember. See if I had a crush on Jaden or Chaz and oh my god, Ojamas, I got all three of them in my first hand. Really Chaz. I really don't wanna go for another Ojama duel. Oh my god, Ojama King. Oh oh no. Hmm. Oh, Oja Magic. Well, I gotta use a, um... Well, that's kind of suckage, and she's already gonna kill me with Dancing Fairy. So straight away, we're in a world of trouble here, because we're using this terrible Ojama deck. I could possibly see the custom one turn out for her as well. Because all I'm getting is Ojamas. Literally. Just Ojamas. If I can get Ojamas Villa, I'll try it of course a few times. Uh she's got she's got a Pikaru deck. Yeah, well, I definitely want Ojama Country. Is there really? Oh. Right. The first thing we want is definitely Ojama Village here. We need that out. Ojama Village is a must. Um, for this deck to work. But why is it all based around Ojama? I don't know. I just got Doubt of Force Hurricane. That's no good to me at this current moment. Um, so yeah, that is really no good to me at this moment. Oh yeah, she gained 5 points because of Pickle is effect. Oh, Fire Princess. So far she hasn't really got that strong of cards, it's more, oh no, well, Dancing Fairy. Shouldn't Dancing Fairy, oh, I shouldn't Pickle. I don't understand this. In the previous duel, you use a uh, Ojama deck on her the opponent's cards, defense, and that are switched. Why is this not switched? I don't understand this. That's kind of broken its own mechanics, hasn't it? Uh, when this card is sent from the hand, or right? Okay, let's do that. Summon you. Yeah, summon you. Yeah, but shouldn't I be able to, uh, well, this sucks. Because now I can't get out all three of them to do Doubt with Force Hurricane or whatever it's called. That kind of sucks. Oh, I have got Fusion Gate though, so screw that. Fusion Gate's coming out now. That's a 